Jim Harbaugh was going to come help me with this, but I guess he couldn't make it. Jim Harbaugh? I'm from Indianapolis, Mr. Little. What's my hero have to do with all this? Uh, he was going to come speak to the class as part of our project. Oh, no. Eric's lost it again. I'm telling you, he was going to be here. That's enough, Mr. Little. Hey, Eric, sorry I'm late. Screech, what are you doing? Jim couldn't make it. I'm filling in. <laughs> you can keep that. It's a souvenir from me, Jim Harbaugh. <laughs> it's great to be here with my friend Eric. <laughs> oh, sorry, guess I've got a strong arm. You've got to have a strong arm to throw a football for the Colts. That's what I do. I'm Jim Harbaugh. <laughs> Screech. I don't think it's working. See you in summer school. Hey, everybody. Look who I found wandering around the halls. You'll never guess who Screech's cousin is. Hi, everyone. I hope I'm not too late. <laughs> Jim, you made it. Everyone's probably just a little bit confused because we look so much alike. But this is my cousin, the real Jim Harbaugh. <laughs> Thanks for clearing that up, Screech. I'm here because my friend Eric has learned the hard way that being famous does not make you a hero. Being a hero isn't about what you do out there on the field. It's about who you are in here. It's about helping your friends, your school, and your community. What a great definition of heroism. You all get an A. Wow. Hey, before you leave, would you autograph my pencil sharpener? Great idea. What? You saved our project, Eric. Maybe you're a hero after all. Thanks, guys. And thank you, Jim. No problem. Anything for a friend of my cuz.